I'm Bill Elsey with Showplace Lawns. We're going to talk about wrapping an electrical cord. We use extension cards for a lot of things in the garden and in the shop, so it's something that we're always having to use and deal with. I'm going to bet that for every person that we have, there's that many ways of rolling one of these things up. Some of them don't make any sense. Some of them we tie ourselves up in it in the process. What I feel is the best way to do this and what I would recommend is to find something like this. Even if you have to buy an extension card that's wrapped on one of these. That is the best thing in the world. It takes the more hassle out of wrapping than anything. You'll see a clip in the middle and what I like to do is you wrap it up opposite of the way you will undo it. You want the plug to be right here on top. So as you start out, you plug it in to where your power source is. And as you go to where you are, you come back to the end that you need out there and you're ready to go. Then when you wrap it up, you start with where you are and work your way back. So. On this particular piece, which is really nice, you can even hang it up on the wall. It's got these middle things. Take this end, clamp it in there like that, clamp it in there like that, and start wrapping. This particular cord is 50 feet long. Now there's more than enough room to roll this up. Of course, the other thing is, as always, as it being an extension cord, it seems like one of its prerequisites is that it's going to tangle up on you before you're finished. So be sure that you got it loose. Continue on. As you come back to your, to your end, I would suggest sticking this through the middle a little bit, pulling it tight. Bringing it back. And there you go.